Hello and welcome to Advanced Facilitation and Modeling. My name is Charlie Bozanier. I have been a certified business analysis professional for nine years and working in the analysis and solution delivery space for 20 years. I have created a course for the University of Washington Professional and Continuing Education Business Analysis Certificate Program, which I taught for five years. I was a contributing writer to the IIBA Babak version three and also the textbook Managing Business Analysts. Currently, I am the business analysis service owner and end user training service owner for King County, Washington. This course represents an updated and compressed version of the course that I continuously improved for the University of Washington's BA certificate program over five years. This subject of facilitation and modeling was once my weak suit as I am not a natural at getting groups together to talk, and I am not a visual thinker. I grew up with six sisters and zero brothers, so I spent most of my formative years listening. Doing otherwise could have been hazardous to my health. There was not a big opportunity to talk, and I was not highly visual in my communication skills because I generally was safest in the hallway closet sitting on top of shoes. And it was dark in there. I overcame my deficiencies through practice, training, and teaching others. Now this set of skills of building consensus and depicting complex situations in a simple way is sort of what I'm known for. A big part of my success, I contribute to the materials I'm going to share with you during the course. These include the Zachman Framework, this exceptional textbook, The Secret of Facilitation by Michael Wilkinson, and also the decision model developed by Barbara Von Halle and Larry Goldberg of Knowledge Partners International. I would like to spend a moment introducing the tools that we will use during the course. The spine of the course, if you will, will be The Secrets of Facilitation, new and revised textbook. If you have not received your copy of this text yet, it is okay because we structured the course to allow us extra time to allow the book to arrive. This book also provides a treasure trove of materials in the form of templates that are available online. We will be using a white paper from Knowledge Partners International and also a decision model primer. We will also reference the Zachman framework. Our modeling tools can either be electronic or manual via whiteboard and this is purely the choice of the individual. Next, I'd like to provide an overview of the course. This has been provided separately in a written syllabus, so you can re review it there as well. But I find the more opportunities that adults have to look at things, the more likely they are to ask questions when something is not clear. So let's start with session one. In session one, we will participate in a facilitated retrospective that will result in user stories for ourselves that we can use later as desired outcomes. Some of these stories will be addressed as we work together for the next several months and others will take a bit longer. Next, in session one, we will spend a period of time talking about the decision model and we'll provide some light practice of modeling decisions in class. Finally, we will cover the Zachman framework and a brief intro to the first step requirements technique. While we will be touching on each of these subjects that will be new to you, there is not a requirement for you to have done any reading or any practicing prior to the first session. Just come as you are. In session two, we will come to class having already read chapter one and chapter two of the Secrets of Facilitation textbook. This should be done as pre-work to the class. I will post a video of what I find most useful about these two chapters for you to review prior to the class week. This unique characteristic of the course that I am focusing on is this combination of modeling and facilitation simultaneously. While the Secrets of Facilitation text is foundational and modeling is common, the delivery of these skills are extremely powerful and advanced when used in combination. It's not common for people to be able to both facilitate 
and to model in the moment while they are leading a group into consensus. We will also talk about the consensus building in greater detail and how the skills presented in the text enable getting to decisions as a group so that our requirements are validated real time in the most meaningful ways possible. In session three, we'll show up having already read the first step white paper from Knowledge Partners International. In this session, we'll uncover the power of preparation and we'll address the first of the five steps to Agile analysis that we learned from the first step technique as the listing of important things, processes, networks, people, schedules or timing, and motivation. We will practice in teams the current and future situation analysis techniques used to develop the scope of any effort that we may encounter. Prior to session four, our pre-work will include the reading of chapters four, five, and seven of the Secrets of Facilitation text and the decision model primer. In session, we will have a group workshop in preparation for the final and fifth session where we will each demonstrate our facilitation skills. We will talk also about the first step method and practice using it on data, process, and workflow and spend a bit more time on the decision model. Prior to session five, each of us, as engaged and working business analysts, will come to class ready to engage again as a facilitator using the skills we've been practicing and discovering. During class, each of us will present the impact of our new skills by demonstrating a bit about our preparation, our delivery, and the work product that resulted from the session. Finally, we'll have a closing retrospective and discuss the results of this course. As you may or may not know, I'm here to build a community of practice with you and with the analysts that work with me. I want to thank each of you in advance for allowing me to participate and to be a part of your busy work day. I can't wait to meet with you and to learn more about the challenges that you face in your jobs. I know we all love business analysis, but having tools and new techniques can really help put the joy back into the work that we do and make us so much more effective. And that's really why we're all here. Thanks again. I'll talk to you soon.